Since the dawn of military aviation, technological advancement has always been a game changer. And when we talk about the United States Air Force, one name consistently stands out, the F-15. For decades, the F-15 family has been synonymous with air superiority. But as warfare evolves, so too must the machines that power our defense. Among the impressive lineup of F-15 variants, two models take center stage in this evolution. The F-15E Strike Eagle and its modern successor, the F-15EX Eagle II. But what makes these two fighters so different? And why is the F-15EX poised to lead the charge in future conflicts? As we dive into their history, design, performance, and technological advancements, consider this. How does upgrading an already formidable aircraft like the F-15E change the way we approach air combat? Are we keeping up with the demands of modern warfare? The F-15E Strike Eagle first took to the skies in December 1986, during a period marked by the Cold War's influence on global politics. Designed as a dual-role fighter, the F-15E excels in both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missions, capable of engaging in dogfights as well as conducting precision bombing runs. It was officially introduced into service with the U.S. Air Force in September 1989 and saw its combat debut during Operation Desert Storm in 1991, where it demonstrated exceptional capabilities, solidifying its role as a critical asset for the United States Air Force. Fast forward to today, and we have the F-15 EX Eagle II. This modern variant was approved for development in 2020, aimed at replacing the older F-15 CD models. However, it is more than just a replacement. It represents a fighter reimagined for contemporary warfare. The F-15 EX incorporates advanced technologies, including enhanced avionics and weapon systems, to effectively address the complexities of modern threats. Its design builds upon the proven success of the F-15E while integrating state-of-the-art capabilities to ensure operational superiority in future conflicts. One of the most fascinating areas where we see a clear distinction between these aircraft is in their design and technology. The F-15 E-Strike Eagle features a cockpit that reflects its 1980s heritage, traditional gauges, and monochrome displays. It was cutting edge back then, but in today's fast-paced, data-driven battlefield, it lacks the real-time processing power that pilots need. Enter the F-15 EX. With its glass cockpit and large area displays, pilots now have access to a fully customizable interface. Information is available at a glance, improving situational awareness and reducing cognitive load. Imagine you're the pilot. How would having mission-critical data streamlined into a single view affect your decision-making in the heat of battle? Now, let's talk power. The F-15EX doesn't just look more advanced, it is more advanced. When it comes to payload, the F-15EX can carry 28% more than its predecessor. That means more bombs, more missiles, and more ways to strike at the heart of the enemy. Think of the F-15EX as the ultimate missile truck, capable of carrying up to 12 air-to-air -air missiles, double the capacity of earlier models. And it's not just about what it can carry. 
both the F-15E and the F-15EX are powered by General Electric engines, but the F-15EX sports improved versions that offer greater thrust and efficiency. Pilots transitioning from the F-15E have reported a noticeable difference in agility, power, and overall performance. While the F-15E is a proven air superiority fighter that also excels at ground support, the F-15EX is designed with a broader scope. It's engineered to anticipate future threats. Its flexibility and ability to carry advanced standoff weapons enable it to complement stealth fighters like the F-35. Let's pause here for a second. In an era where stealth is often king, why would the Air Force double down on the F-15EX, a non-stealth fighter? The answer lies in its versatility. The F-15EX is designed to operate alongside stealth aircraft, delivering overwhelming firepower where it's needed most. And, with training times as short as two weeks for pilots already familiar with the F-15E, this transition is almost seamless. Lastly, the technological enhancements of the F-15EX take it beyond the capabilities of previous generations. The F-15EX features the Eagle Passive Active Warning Survivability System, or EPAWS, which revolutionizes how the aircraft handles electronic warfare. This system provides simultaneous jamming, threat identification, and geolocation, making it much harder for enemies to get a lock on the aircraft. Additionally, the F-15EX's advanced radar system, an active electronically scanned array, offers superior detection and tracking capabilities. It's not just about seeing the enemy first. It's about being able to track multiple targets at greater distances while remaining resistant to jamming. So, when we look at these two extraordinary aircraft, the F-15E Strike Eagle and the F-15EX Eagle II, we see a journey of evolution. The F-15E made its mark in the skies of the Gulf War and beyond, proving its worth in air superiority and ground attack. The F-15EX, meanwhile, stands ready to take on the challenges of the future. Its advanced technology, superior payload, and flexible operational roles make it a fighter that can adapt to the unpredictable nature of modern combat. As we prepare for future conflicts, one question remains, are we ready for the challenges that lie ahead? With the F-15EX in the air, the United States Air Force certainly thinks so. But what do you think? Can this next generation fighter meet the demands of tomorrow's battlefield? That's all for today. Thank you for watching.